I heard Mio managed to save Kairi just as she was being attacked by a bunch of Kvesi soldiers. No big surprise there. She's powerful, stylish, kind. She's just about perfect in every single way. Is that really what this is? <laughs> Why does it have a picture of, um, what's-her-face? Ethel on it. That has nothing to do with Mio. <laughs> Are the Xenoblade games linked in plot? God, no. Every single game is a different storyline. <laughs> they don't even take place in the same universe, technically. Yeah, it's many dead things, but they're all clustered together, unlike in the second game. Also, I can finally open this. I didn't open it before. I'll follow you. Because I didn't want to open it off-camera. I'm pretty sure this is just a container, though. Uh... Yep. I don't know why they bother putting the thing in front of it. <laughs> and... and that big bird dragon that we saw last time up at the top of the mountain up there... Um... Turns out it's a level 100 unique monster. Which means it's the first super boss of the game. Uh, <laughs> we won't be getting to that for a very long time, if ever. Alright, request from Teach is the side quest. Role models. Catch up on stuff. Wonder if we've become more like Ethel. What's that about Ethel? I mean, like, we saved Kairi from the hands of the enemy earlier, yeah? That's kind of like when Ethel saved us way back when. Huh. Yeah, she did do that. Haven't thought about that in a while. And this time, we were the rescuers. It's kind of emotional to think about. Oh, but remember, she took on a Levness that day all by her own spark and self. And that was in her third term. Uh, yeah, she did do that. I guess if it were easy to be Ethel, everyone would be doing it. I'd heard rumors, but it seems they were, if anything, vastly understated. What a formidable warrior. Wow, thinking about trying to match Ethel makes me feel less confident than other. <laughs> we can still work hard to become someone that someone else might want to emulate. How about that? And of course, the quest from first, Teach. Right? So Teach, what's this favor that you wanted to ask? Okay, I'm just going to come out and say it. I want to know if you'd consider teaching the newbies in Colony Gamma. In an instructional capacity? Colony Gamma's flame clock was broken by your hand, Ouroboros. But the conflict between Kevis and Agnes continues. If things get more violent, then my newbies are going to need to be proficient in battle and they're going to survive. And you want us Kevesi crew to teach them what we know? Yes, that's why I asked you. The training will be all the more meaningful coming from you. So, there's an extra dimension to this? Yes, if you teach them, you'll become the model for them to emulate. You want them to emulate us? Kevis is supposed to be our implacable enemy, only living to bring Agnes down. But you overturned those biases and came to an understanding among yourselves. So I want them to take you as their role models to shake up their ideas. You want them to relax their aggression and wariness towards Kevis? Having such strong feelings with nowhere to vent them is going to eventually drive people to fight over nothing. I think it's vital to teach them this, to keep them away from war. I understand. Well, in that case, we'll be only too happy to help out. I've got to say, this is my first ever teaching job. Where should we start? Yeah. Don't worry about that. I'll support you through the beginner program. First, I'll post the news that you've been made teachers along with the personal histories of the Colony Bolton Board. Based on the bulletin board posting, the soldiers will decide who they want to learn from. An unusual method, letting the students choose their teacher? Right, this method emphasizes their independence. But if you do it this way, surely everyone will just choose Mio. Not at all. The new recruits are genuinely curious about all of you. Guess we'll find out. Let's give it a go. I've never taught either, but I'll do my best to not let you down. You know, I believe it coming from you. Thank you so much for helping me out with this. Now go out there and lead those newbies into a new future. Teaches teachers. I don't know if we want to do this right now because we've been putting off the story right, for some time. time <laughs> Instruct the newbies teams. Zero of six. Oh boy. I don't actually know how this works though. Teaching requests. 
Live combat training or theoretical knowledge? Uh, theoretical knowledge. Teacher, Tyon. Students, Team Zakir, Zakir, Mina, and Shun. Tutor of Tyon. And then... Live combat training. Teachers, Senna and Uni. Students, Team Foots, being Foots, Naguma, and Yusora. This sounds pretty serious. Group chat first, right? This is gonna take a bit. Uni, a teaching assignment's come in for us. Yeah, looks like it. Although I'm shocked they even wanted me. You're a lot easier to approach than me or Lance. Even in Colony 9, all the young'uns loved you. Hate to say it, but you're a, just a surprisingly caring person. Two ashes with your surprisingly. So what idiots have asked for us? <laughs> yeah, um, about that. You were asked by the Foot Squad. They're a strong team, skilled in battle, mainly attackers and defenders. They enjoy fighting a bit too much, but they're pretty exceptional soldiers. They're Captain Foots in particular. Oh, that don't sound too bad. A bunch of hot-blooded newbies. Don't take them lightly, Uni. Especially Foots. He's super rude. Especially to me. I have no idea why. Oops, sounds like they don't take you seriously. Sounds to me like we've got ourselves a prime opportunity. We can knock this attitude out of their heads while we whip them out into shape. I don't think whipping is called for. We just need to show them we're on a totally different level to them. That'll keep them from mouthing off, yeah? Oh. Yeah, that makes sense. Then let's whip them good. <laughs> then it's settled. Looks like we got some rookies to teach. Oh yeah, we gotta do what we gotta do. Um, you know these are just new recruits you're talking about, right? Don't break them. Why is Senna on fire? She just like that. <laughs> Gotta be honest. We should talk about this. It's because she's a blade, Kiwi. So Noah, did anybody request you as a teacher? Nope. They're probably a bit wary of us. No surprises there, huh? Still, it's kind of depressing. Noah, word. What? Uh, yeah. Go on. They asked if I'd teach too, but I'm not confident to do it alone. I'd appreciate your help, if you wouldn't mind. Yeah, no problem. I'll do whatever I can. Go on, I'll give you a hand too, mate. That's okay, Noah's all I need. <laughs> Aw, come on, the more the merrier, am I right? I'll only be teaching theory, so... You know what I'm getting at. Ah, gotcha. Yeah. Hey, what are you getting at? Are you calling me stupid? I didn't say that, but do you even want to be involved? Ugh. Well, if I was there, Noah wouldn't get his time to shine, so... Out of the pure goodness of my heart, I'll let him have this one. Knock him dead, Noah. Ha, <laughs> yeah, okay. Get yourself ready, and then I'll see you in the Colony Square, if that's okay. <laughs> Alright, see you later, Hope Boy. Have a good... Have a good night, regardless. Yeah, sounds good. See you there, Tyon. Let's do theoretical knowledge first, I think. We've got to do going. six minor quests to finish this minor quest. I did think you'd be the ones who asked for me as a teacher. What gave us away? You've always been so enthusiastic about asking me things. Well, yeah, I respect you pretty highly as a strategist. I thought you'd have some good lessons to teach, so maybe it was presumptuous of me. But yes, I put you forward for it. I'm just a little puzzled. I don't remember asking for this Kavesi. Oh, I, uh... I'm the one who asked him. He's going to assist me in teaching. So today's lesson will consist of several problems you'll be expected to solve. I want to gauge your understanding of basic tactics and situational awareness. No objections to your plan here. But I do have a problem with that guy being involved in the teaching. I see. And what do you two think? As a member of Captain Zakir's team, I'll abide by his decision. I... I will... I agree with, uh, Mina. <laughs> I'm not going to go against Commander Teach on this. I just don't think I have enough information to judge whether Kevas is trustworthy. That's the truth. As someone who intends to be the next commander, it's kind of my job to look into these things. That would be a big job, so what's to be done now? Zoom in on Noah's face for five seconds. Look. How about if I answer Tyon's questions as well, then? Bleh. Wait, why, though? 
Well, you know, it's always easier to solve something like this with a straightforward contest, right? That makes no sense at all. It doesn't make a difference to me, Tyon. So you're okay with this? It's at least a better way to end it than each prodding at the other to test their nerve wasting time. Better to have a contest with a clear winner and loser. Very confident of you. It suits me just fine. Whatever then, but just don't forget that we're all here to learn, okay? Let me get permission to use the War Council area. That would be appreciated. We'll meet later then. Agreed. Later. Secure at Mina or Shun. Here you are. Then, shall we start with some combat related problems? Yeah. Which one of these is not a benefit of inflicting days? It's all allies recover HP. What name is given to class specific techniques? Talon arts. Uh, whose role is it to attract the enemy's de attention? Defenders. Uh, what happens to some enemies when they're in trouble? They get enraged. What should an attacker typically do if targeted by the enemy? Uh, pull back and give up. <laughs> pull back and wait for a defender to exist. To assist. Not exist. That's all the combat questions I've got. Let's take a quick break. Whew. Looks like you're having some trouble. Don't let it get you down. No need to worry about me. My score will show you. I'm sure. Don't look so much like you're going to skip out in the middle of the ride. No fear. I'll see it through to the end. Hi, hi! What do you mean? <laughs> Joel comes in and immediately insults me. That's short energy right there. <laughs> What's up next, Tyon? Next is questions related to situational awareness. That is vital for battle. Absolutely. No gaps in my knowledge. Maybe I'll study up just to be safe. No, I know how this stuff works. This is just testing your game knowledge. Here you are. Next. How are you doing, Joel? Who led their colony to victory over three colonies simultaneously? Ethel, right? Which statement about the flame clocks in the iris is correct? In Kevis, it's in the left eye. That's wrong. In Kevis, it's in the right eye. Agnes, in the left. That would be correct. What's the highest rank in a colony? Commander. Because the consul isn't part of the colony, so... What equipment is exclusive to Kevesi soldiers? Power frames. What does black fog cause? Well, none of these are correct, but it wants me to answer annihilation event. Remember what Mary told me? Lung cancer. I don't think those sentences are connected. Let's see how you both measure up. Team Zakir is a good grasp of the subject. You like to give us some pretty fiendish questions, Tyon. So I did my research. And as for Noah, good effort, but you were just a whisker away from Team Zakir's score. Oh. It causes lung cancer. I don't think that's true. I absolutely want you to teach this stuff to them. To whom? Kyrie and Foots. They're not good at sitting quietly. They need to learn more about combat situations that they can't brute force their way out of or leave to chance. Their carelessness will tarnish Commander Teach's good name. When it comes to Foots, since peacetime hasn't, he hasn't had any respect for Commander Teach, which is why he'll never be platoon leader. Zakir, isn't there something you should be saying before all this? Right, yeah, sorry. You're right, Mina. Noah, isn't it? Let's not beat around the bush. What do you have to say for yourself? <laughs> Nothing. I lost and I accept that. I have no right to... Zakir, even if Noah had won the competition, it wouldn't have made you trust the Kavesi anymore. Am I right? Absolutely right. No result can change the way I feel. 
Honestly, this whole little competition thing meant nothing to me from the start. I think that the fact that you agreed to it is important, though. You're optimistic, aren't you? I think what we need is to compromise bit by bit. Whatever form that takes, whether it's playing games like this or being honest about our feelings or whatever, I think the important thing is that we come to know each other. <laughs> Getting to know each other. We don't mean you any harm, we just want to help. That's the truth, I just want you to know. Those are some big words. Okay then, prove it. Prove what? I want you to stand in front of my soldiers with the proper attitude, is what I mean. For now, I deem you an acceptable instructor. Oh, oh, thank you. Don't thank me, and don't get the wrong idea. I'm respecting Commander Teach's wishes, that's all. What does that... Jewel, neither of those things are correct. Wow, has she finally shown up? <laughs> Looks that way. Can you both just not? <laughs> Sorry, Senna. These guys were raised by Ferris's. Oh, uh, no need to apologize, Asora. Right, Senna's the one who made us wait, after all. That she did. Okay, that's enough. Looks like someone's in need of a little discipline, right, Senna? Right, yes, exactly. In no time like the present, eh, loves? Mock battle time. Time for some hard weightlifting. What? Uh, hey, what happened to whipping him good? Mock battle's the best whip there is. Is it, though? This is totally weightlifting's time to shine. Why? You want to pump iron, so what? We just sit this one out? <laughs> we can all do it with them, right? We gotta show them we're on different level. That ain't what I had in mind. Yeah, I don't think uni is good for that. <laughs> Guys, don't fight. You all want to do some strength training, right? Everyone wants to get strong. Yeah, no mock battle it is. I'm going to teach you runts to fight. Psh. Mock battle sounds fine. Wait just a second. Did you just psh at me? You must have imagined it. All in your head. See, I strength train every day. Honestly, I wanted to prove myself against you. Take on a real-life Kavesi soldier. What he said. I wouldn't put it like that, but I think it'd be a good experience. Aw oh, man, you too, Asora. The majority has spoken. These little scamps are all full of beans, so a good mock battle's perfect to wear them out. Wow, looks like the Kavesi understands us better than even the illustrious Senna does. So let's show her how tough we are. We'll be waiting for you in the training ground. Don't run away in terror, yeah? Then quit yapping and get yourselves ready. <laughs> They don't have respect for me at all. <laughs> it's true, though. They don't. <laughs> hey, Teach. Are these lessons of yours really that tough? Always nice if to have more friends. If you need some guidance, you are always welcome. All right. <laughs> it might make me use just Senna and Uni for this, which would actually be not good. Love and hate are just one step apart from each other. That's true. Please, Aru, no. <laughs> yeah, I agree with Jewel on this one. Sorry. Don't try any funny business like letting us win or whatever. Don't worry your pretty little head about that. You'll regret taking me on. Look at that. She gets it. Then let's begin. Oh, yeah. Okay, good. The entire party's fighting. There are six of them. Foots is probably the hardest to kill. That's okay, though. Go for burst combo. Tyon is taking a lot of damage, but that's mostly because there are six enemies. The Zephyr class is awesome, by the way. It's just incredibly good. Just being able to dodge is such a good effect. 
and not very many classes have that option right now. There's so much on screen. Yeah, that's Xenoblade. Uh, normally, those rings around our characters aren't there. Those are just there to show aggro. Did I just level up? What just happened? Okay, so looks like Nagumo is an evasion focused character. Yeah, when there's a lot of enemies in one fight, it does get a bit cluttered. I agree with that. I don't think we need to use a chain attack in this fight. We're doing fine. We killed one of them without me ever targeting it. Okay, that guy's dead. And Isora is the only one left, so... Where is she? Oh, she's the healer. That's why nobody was targeting her. And she's dead. Perfect. Easy quest. That was. How? They're too strong. Ha ha ha, I love it. This, this is the exact thing I wanted. Oh, you look like you want to go another round. That's right, not going to let you take a, your win and go. Woohoo, it's all kicking off now. Bring it. You gonna make me fight again? Okay. Only four of them this time, though. I see. Okay. Reverse combos as usual. Oh, I see. Nagumo and Foots are stronger now. They've got the enraged meter on their bar. I think they're also hitting harder. I could be imagining that. Let me just get a little residual healing quick. Multi-blast doesn't heal very much. It's meant to be used as a fusion skill. Oh, he's bound. This poor man. <laughs> he couldn't do anything. I think it's Teach that inflicts Bind, because I never saw that before he was in the party. Why are you going into Ouroboros? That is a big waste on these guys. <laughs> this is not necessary, Noah. Oh! This guy just enraged herself. I didn't even realize it was Isora. I thought it was a regular dude. Well, that wasn't too bad. I can't. I need a break. Isora, Isora, are you okay? Why are you freaking out? Ah, Nagumo, you'll shatter my eardrums. Watch, Isora, I'll avenge you. Oh my goodness, he's still going? Does he scare you? Bad habit for someone your term. Hey, you can't say that. One more round. Nagumo, you up for it? Who? yeah, I'll beat you black and blue. Why are we still fighting? Why are we fighting these two guys three times each? <laughs> This quest seems unnecessary. And I've been target locked again. Do I not? Oh, I don't have anybody that can inflict break on this team. I was wondering why topple was never happening. This is some masochist quest. No, because it's not even hard. That's the thing. Though he does have a lot of HP now. I hope all six quests aren't this bad. Though it might just be the two of them as well. They're just some... <laughs> the masochist is the ones fighting you? That's true. 
Oh, Tyon's dead. All right, well, at least I am a tank. Ooh, I'm taking a lot of damage, actually. Look at Teach's health. I can't hold both of their aggro because one of them keeps stealing it from me. Prideful Call? I've never seen that It's chain attack. Yeah, these guys are actually tough now. Dragon Unbound is healing, so let's do that. Alright, teach. Uh, when chosen, grants 10 TP to all active characters except Cell. Yeah, that sounds nice. Rank splitter. I should have done... No, because if I did him first, then it wouldn't have mattered. Let's go with... I can't finish the thing with a uh, green, so let's go with Senna for now. Yeah, they really do want to get beaten. Nice. How's this for a plan? Uh, yeah, we'll do Grave Assault. That was a lot of points, Uni, for a 25. <laughs> Oh, I don't have an attacker left. Oops. This will work, I guess. Why does Tyon never have a final move equipped? <laughs> I need to go in and fix that. I don't know why it's always Tyon as well. Nice kill, Noah. Jeez. How close that was, jeez. Now the downside to this is that I'm not actually dealing damage to foots. But that's okay. Oh, I have to do the other two first, because otherwise it won't. Bill properly. I got exactly 99 anyways. Alright, big impact. Blam. Thousand damage. That was like 500% bonus experience or something like that. Oh, wow. So glad I have three supports. Oh, he's attacking the Ouroboros. That's good. Why have I been launched? <laughs> okay, yeah, this guy's way easier to kill than the other one. Good night, Foots. Are we done yet? <laughs> That took a long time to beat one group of enemies. Ah, snuff you. Haha, <sighs> we're in trouble, Nagamo. They're amazing. Puts and Nagamo were giving them everything they had, but this lot are in a different league. <laughs> yeah? Ah, uh, lo you lot ain't so bad. And you've got nerve. Yeah, we do. But I can't stand it. You look so fresh. You look so fresh, Miss Uni. Feel free to challenge me anytime, though, as long as you don't mind losing. 
Ha, <laughs> that's some big talk. In that case, I'm happy to keep challenging you. I look forward to seeing your face when we beat you. Sound good to you, Miss Uni? Ah! Uh, <laughs> Miss Uni? Oh, and Senna, you better be ready too. Yeah, be prepared, Senna. Why don't I get a nice title? But I'll let it slide for today. I'm knackered. No, you don't get to decide when the lesson's over. This is where it really begins. Uh, what? You've shown you want to get stronger, so let's have a little strength training competition. Strength training? You know, actually, I'm done for... You want to beat us, don't you? Then strength training is the only way. Now you're all done warming up, you should be in tip-top condition. It has to be now. You have to train. It's the only way. Train your muscles. Is she serious? This is what I mean when I say you two are too cocky. Oh dear, oh dear. Well, do your best. I'll be cheering you on from here. Hey, you're going to join in too, right, Miss Uni? <laughs> Senna deserves respect, honestly. <laughs> is as vibrant as ever once again thanks to you okay well that's All the hard work two of them you say that out of them? six right no teaching requests really wait is the quest done oh the recommended level is 57. All right, I guess we're not doing the rest of this quest right now. <laughs> okay, so that's a long one. Yeah, I got a fortune clover, so I know where to get them. Uh, that collectopedia card that requires seven can still go away. I don't want it. Oh, there's more info here? Erin and her team haven't contacted us ever since they started their expedition into Danag Desert. Maybe they think we're still at war. Expeditory mission, one of two. That's certainly new. I've been hearing the Offseer's flute around the living quarters lately. Radek's Offseer successor shouldn't have been assigned yet, though. What's going on, I wonder? There's... a lot of side content, huh? Do I have to talk? I guess I have to talk to him because he's alone. Have you seen the third unit's levenesses? They're late coming back. I don't, I don't mind admitting I'm worried. I warn them time and time again not to go neglect their maintenance. Ugh, Aaron. Snuff it. Can you go out and see what's what, then see what Yuzet has to say about it? Okay. So it looks like there's a lot more side stuff to do here. No, I don't want to talk to the mech friend. What was it they needed again? All right, that's the most stinger piles I can turn in at once. This doesn't require any though, so I'm gonna do this first. Twenty percent per. I can do this. We're doing splendor stinger. That was forty percent. Okay, so it's still not quite done. So we need more stinger piles, basically. Oh, there it is. That Nopon's flute playing is ear-bleedingly bad. <laughs> Tell me about it. That was an Offseer's flute being played, wasn't it? Why has a Nopon got something like that? There we go. Alright. First off, I'm switching Teach to be in the party again. That's the map. And they're both regular quests. Colony 30's Offseer. Been enjoying Evo? Sweet. There sure are plenty of Nopon in Colony 30, huh? We certainly don't have any colonies in Agnes with that many Nopon. Crazy. Oh yeah, talking of crazy, looks like somebody weird was bound to show up among all those furballs. I think one of them is going around playing an Offseer's flute. Yeah, I've heard that too. But his playing's kinda crappy and it's cheesing everyone off. He's playing it around the colony. Could he be training? I think he might be right. I'm not upon training to be an Offseer. 
I kind of want to meet this guy. All right then, shall we drop by the Colony 30 Residential District? People have been hearing a flute there a lot. Let's do it. Serene Melody. <laughs> and then Expeditionary first, Mission. Right? Sounds like contact with the Levness unit dispatched by Colony 30 was lost in Denai Desert. That's the unit Ven was worried about, right? Communications are often disrupted in Denai Desert. It could be down to the sandstorms that are prevalent there. Then maybe the people in that unit still think they need to fight. But we destroyed the Colony 30 flame clock. Looks like they didn't get the message, love. Someone better tell them that they don't need to kill anymore. Looks like we'll have to meet with them face to face. Yep, off to Denek Desert we go. That is the first quest where I have to go that way. <laughs> Notice me that Dragon Ball Fighters is getting rollback netcode. I don't play fighting games, so unfortunately that doesn't mean anything to me, but it sounds like a lot of people like rollback netcode, so... Can't forget our progress update. Either that or it's another member of uh, Alexandria's squad, in which case we're not doing that for a long time. See me, me is his name. It's more stable. It works a lot better. Usually delay based when playing against people far away. Okay, you the Napon who plays an offseer flute. Meh, meh. See me, me. Sorry. Stop soon. Hmm. What was that about? Looks like something's going on. Let's do a bit of asking around and then come back and talk to the Nopon. Good plan. Let's see what the people of Colony 30 have to say. Always nice to have more friends. This is just the Nopon, right? <laughs> no, it's Zuza. The Nopon with the Offseer flute? Yeah, that's Simimi. Why is the Nopon trying to be an Offseer? I'm pretty sure it was to take Radek's place after he was killed in battle, so Colony 30 would still have an Offseer. Those two were really close. Oh, I see. Around Evo playing rounds on practically any game available with a modded Guitar Hero guitar having changed the strum bar for a joystick. <laughs> That's pretty cool, honestly. <laughs> Seeing people use controllers that are not meant for the video game and then being good at it. You want to know about the Nopon with the flute? Sorry, I'm a bit busy with some maintenance work right now, so I can't really think about anything else. Oh, actually, though, there was a snoozing Nopon in my way, so I took the fur back to the first aid station, and I could hear this ash awful tune. First aid station? Okay, thanks. How's the Offseer melody practice going, Simimi? Meh meh meh, don't ask, please. That bad, eh? You know, Simimi, if you want, I can take over Offseeing. No, that impossible! It promised between Radek and Simimi. But... Hi, Simimi. Oh. You. We heard you're practicing an Offseeing tune. Can we help? Meh. You Offseer? <laughs> Do you want to become an Offseer? See Mimi want to send off Friend. What about the Colony's Offseer? Friend of See Mimi was Colony Offseer. So See Mimi have to send off. See Mimi have favor to ask. Teach Offseeing melodies to See Mimi. Then... Then take See Mimi to where Redek is. We can do that. Husk of Redek lie in Rutes Bar. See Mimi and friends go there. Who's the egg? That's along. a Napon. They're great. Uh, Rutez Bar is closer to where I need to go for the main story, so let's go for the other quest for now. The Missing Squad, level 23. Yeah, we're a little high level. <laughs> not gonna lie. Oop, not the affinity chart. I don't care about that. That's a lot of... Levis. Levis. Levness? Levnesses. The Devil's Skillet. Okay, what an area name. <laughs> Looks like this is where I need to be for this quest. Let's make our mark. 
Apex Wing. Defeat the specified foes, the Agnes Recon Squad. They're level 23. This shouldn't be too bad. Testado, Alvis. Alright. See, even though we're five levels up on these guys, they could still be legitimately tough because of how this game is balanced. Desert do be looking kind of cool. Oh yeah, no. Desert is always one of my favorite areas in a video game. Just look at Spectro's Origins Desert. That place is awesome. I wish I'd finished that game. That was the last area I got to in it. Body cannon? Okay, that hurt a bit. It's dead now. Hey, Kara, how's it going? How are you today? When are you getting your frames back? <laughs> Love how massive the party is in this game after Xenoblade 2 having a four party member limit. I think it was three party members. I just found out my audio jack actually functions as a microphone jack, and now I can use my PC on my headset. My mic on my headset. Yeah, it does that. Thanks for the backup. Who are you, though? We came to bring you back home. Ben was worried about you. Ben, really? I still don't think you know, though. I know you, though. We're friends of Valdi. We're friends of Valdi. Do you know the commander? I thought if you weren't a Levness, he wasn't interested, to be honest. I hope they stay, too. Okay, but why have you come looking for us? We broke Colony 30's flame clock. You don't need to take life in order to survive anymore. What? Can you prove it? Uh, yeah, check your iris. What? Ah, there's no flame clock. What about Ven? He was concerned about your neglecting maintenance or something to that effect. Very like Fen. Prepare to head back. Roger. You've spared us from who knows how many senseless battles. Thank you. And say hi to Ven for us. Yeah, they just hadn't checked their irises the entire time. <laughs> oh, there's a sandstorm. I hope everyone's getting along. Okay. Uh, let's check. That's where I just was. Let's go over and check the other quest marker, though, because there is a second one here. Is it not going to let... Oh. I was standing on moving ground. Of course it wasn't going to let me check. I wanted to try to get to that... <laughs> Thing. Maybe I have to go from the cave down below? Because there's not one up here. Which is interesting. Uh, this might kill me, actually. It didn't. Oh, it's just full of caterpiles. Milio Trick Caverns. I'd be amazed if I see a rat in my house. I live on the 20th floor. That's a bit of an extenuating circumstance, though, isn't it? We might need to come back to this area later, because there's a big door. Also, Pawn Arachnos are really weak. I killed one off-screen to get the materials for one of the gems. And it, it died really fast. <laughs> oh, I leveled up during that as well. Point of interest. Doesn't look like there's any other paths. Unknown trick devices. Some doors are fitted with special trick locks and will only open if you can solve their puzzles. Use L and R to turn the left and right eyes. The objective of this puzzle is to get a red piece into each of the green spaces. Okay.
What? <laughs> Wait, was there like a limit to the number of moves I could make there? Because that was not a puzzle at all. Though it did say correct a mundo when I got it right, so... I don't really want to fight these guys if I don't have to, because I don't want to get too much experience. We're already overleveled. I think that one was just very simple. Probably, yeah. You are just a regular Arachno. I don't care about this ether thing, because I've got 90 ether cylinders, so who cares? You can come back and get it later. When we actually need it. I hear fighting to my right. Wow, this guy does not want to leave. It's fine, it can't get to me from there. There's a husk here. I see. So I'm gonna have to kill these two guys to get through. Two elites in one fight might be a little tricky, though we are still five levels up on them. Uni is taking a lot of damage. Why do my attackers have aggro? Missed. Yeah, this is actually looking kind of tough. Here. Let me get aggro better. Shackle blocking. That's an interesting one. That did not help as much as I would have hoped. You need health there. <laughs> I do. I actually really like the elite music in this game. <laughs> oh, I'm taking a lot of damage now. Cool. An actual tough fight. Will the elites have the same name as the enemy type that they would normally be? Only the unique monsters have different names. How is this one still alive? I'm about to go down, actually. I've got uh, no block right now. Conquered. Good for class points. Where did these items come from? Oh, those are just normal collectibles. The guy had a lot of health. You know, mu Xenoblade music is just great. Oh, I died. Cool. This should be fine. Well, I wish Uni wasn't the one who held the aggro for me. This guy has a lot of health. It's like fighting the big robots in the world tree. Almost. At least that speed without chain attack. Heal me a little. Or miss, that works too. They have high agility. Dive break, spider web. I'm about to go down again, that's fine. I'm about to go down. What is Teach doing? He's just running in place. There I went. Uni is also almost dead. Well, we did it. That was a little bit 
rough. It was almost just slow, honestly. <laughs> Dying isn't that big of a deal. Yeah, I was right in thinking that would open the door, at least. Gotta get the soldier husk. That's just affinity. How did he get in here? <laughs> Also, I'm pretty sure this is leading exactly where I wanted it to, too. Looks like a pretty rare specimen. Rare caterpillar. I could use more caterpillar materials, I guess. Let me see what you can do. Also got rid of the elite that just would not de-aggro. That's true. Yeah. But I didn't want to de-aggro anyways. I'm a tank. I want them to be targeting me. Hey, look at that guy just embedded in the wall. Nice. There's gotta be a unique monster in here, right? There's no way it's just another door. This one almost looks easier. Like, watch this. <laughs> that's easy. Uh, before the fight, would just not stop trying to chase you. Oh yeah, that's true. Alright, is this the spot I was thinking of? I don't think it is. I think we're in the wrong spot. Make our mark. Sage's Garden location discovered. Huh. Yes, I'm correct. This is not... Oh, I need to go behind that door. Alright, let me pick up these collectibles first. Sickle Cricket Fossil. <laughs> I need a Fossil Monkey Fossil for my upgrades right now. Correctamundo. Can I even open this door? Is the question? Yes. Okay, why is it here then? Sage's domicile. Hello, Berber. Pleased to first speak with Master Pon Berber. Seek Seek is only humble first secretary. Always nice to have more friends. Meh, you there, tell your thoughts. What thoughts? Thoughts from experiencing masterpieces of Berber. Do these masterpieces happen to be those huge puzzle devices that open the doors on the way here? Oh, so friends did enjoy. D did you make it so people could enjoy it? Berber did do that. Berber want to share moments of excite and delight with all peoples. Well, uh, excitement is one word for it. That most important thing. But Berber aware that this method unsatisfactory. Berber will give enough even more thrill and spill experience to thrill seeker friends. Berber has hidden Napon coinage all over the world. And now Berber want friends to find them and bring them back. Here is hint of hiding place. They are in mighty excitey places. Of course Berber has also arranged reward system. First bring fifteen Napon coins. Oh, not to forget, is coins of silver that Berber request. So this is another use for silver coins. And it's also a quest. So, uh... Always nice to have more friends. <laughs> at least I have that many coins, I guess. Also, there's three... There's five just right behind him. Need to cool to Mondo cool. Oh, ho, ho! Have friends already collected some? Right now, wings of Berber all dirty. Napon coins get covered in sand if touch. Friends should give Napon coins to Seek Seek. Seek Seek will reward handsomely. Master Pon Berber brings Seek Seek up to date. First Secretary Seek Seek train taking all over all Napon coin receipt duty duties in place of very busy Master Pon. Friends know that Napon coins come in gold and silver. Friends can exchange number of Napon coins for reward. So then, Seek Seek has prepared for reward for bring Napon coins, so when ready, give Seek Seek shout. I hope everyone's getting along. I'm trying. Here are available uh, rewards. Decisions, decisions. 
potions. Recharge speed by 25% while in water. <laughs> That's insanely good when fighting unique monsters in the water. Uh... Healing art recharge speed when 25% when an ally is at low HP. 10% chance to grant power charge when evading. That's insane. Uh, boost ally revival speed for each incapacitated ally. Reduce aggro towards self by 5% when an auto attack hits. Extends area of effect of attack arts which have one by 50%. 10% chance to keep recharge when using an art. This is a uh, Finch's passive skill from Xenoblade 2, and it's insanely good when you're lucky. Uh, on blocking, boost recharge of a one art at random by 10%. Uh, at start of chain attack, increase TP by 10. That... I might just get this. This is absurdly powerful. Uh... 100% chance to survive a KO with 1 HP and 5 seconds of invincibility once per battle. Uh, allows reviving allies even when not in a healer role. That costs 99 golden coins. <laughs> that is absolutely not worth that much money. <laughs> I'm getting the analyzer scope. And then I have to get the shell necklace for the quest, so. It's pleasure doing business with friends. Master Pawn exceeding happy since friends came. Before friends leave, please say hello to Master Pawn. Oh ho, are friends having excited adventures out in world? I guess so. Oh ho ho, Berber glad to hear. Berber remember thrill of finding first Napon coin. Berber not stop grinning for seven whole days. Berber want friends to feel same way. Berber hidden more Napon coins and friends can count. Friends must search all Ionios with great excitement. Of course, rewards will keep on coming. What rewards, friends ask? Seek, seek, tell, answer. Now please keep having more thrilling fun. And I get four coins as a reward, so I get a little bit of a refund. That was... That was certainly something, I guess. Like, this leads to this side quest. I hope. If it doesn't, I'm going to be disappointed. <laughs> Not like this. Something so valuable here. Khaki kernel. Let's make our mark. Oh, yeah, we're in Root's Bar now. That's exactly where we need to be. <laughs> That's convenient. There's also dogs up here. Very cool. You're not seriously going to make me go further up the hill to get to that, huh? <laughs> Yo, what the heck is happening over here? What's that? The Tableland Hulk accepted. What? What did I... I mean, I see... Oh, it's a fast travel point I can unlock. Okay. I just need to kill the Ferrises around, and then I can turn it on with an ether thing. You are what you eat, and you surely do sound like a child. <laughs> what does that mean? Radek, see Mimi come, just like promise. See Mimi, sorry Radek, have to wait so long. Still not sound right. I'll teach you the melody. We'll send them together. Okay. Who send off Seer? 
In past, see Mimi ask Redek this. Redek say he can't die because duty of Redek is to send everyone. So you see Mimi promise to do for Redek. I see. Thankings. Goodbye, Redek. Quest complete. And I get silver coins for that, that's sick. Alright, let's unlock this Hulk then. What do I have to kill for it? Because <laughs> I know I have to kill something. Defeat monsters dwelling around the Pharaonis Hulk. Ten of them. So it needs me to kill all of these Pharises. That might take a little bit, but I'll do it. <laughs> Because it is, in fact, a side quest. Ha! We'll be done in a blink. This one looking at me funny. Hey, you. Oh, another one saw me. That's okay. Tyon immediately dashed over and hit it in the face. So that's an elite walking towards me. Uh, and it saw me. Okay. Well, this is gonna be fun. It seems. Rain. Mio is about to die. <laughs> wow, there's a lot of things attacking me right now. Get rid of this thing fast, it's actually killing me. Okay, good. Oh boy, that's damage. Goodbye, Land Ferris. Well fought, everyone. <laughs> All right, those things are kind of tough, actually. It's the only thing that can damage me. There's another one attacking us right now. A little bit annoying, but ultimately not a problem. Ring. It's not even that Uni is just violence, I just need her to level up. <laughs> I want to get everybody's classes all leveled up by the end of this playthrough, because that just seems like a good thing to do, honestly. Ahem. What? I'll hit him, and then I'll hit him again. Oh, that, yeah. She always says that when switching to an offensive class, though. Too easy. Come after me, and that's what you get. If only you didn't charge off on your own. Ah, <sighs> had to sneeze. <laughs> Thank you. Let me see what you can do. You're dealing with me. Senna, love to see it. Quick. Smooth as always, Noah. No, 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 Fight them all at once. Whoa! <laughs> I didn't think I could switch characters mid fight. That's new. I was wondering why my camera changed. I was controlling Lance for a second. That's, I guess, good to know? 
I don't think I'm ever going to do that practically, though. That scratch and bark attack is really strong. There we go. Hulk monsters defeated. Now I just need to put the ether cylinder in. At least I hope it's one. I actually hope that this costs like 30 to turn on. If I'm being real with you. Because I, I need to get rid of some of these ether cylinders. Yeah, it's 10. That's better than 1, I guess. But I have so much ether that I can't even carry anymore. Anyways, that's a new fast travel point and a new place where I can uh, craft materials. The Ferranus Hulk rebooted. That's only the second time we've done that. The first time was like 20 in-game hours ago. <laughs> I want to use the Fabricator a couple times, because that'll get us a bunch of materials that we couldn't get otherwise, I'm pretty sure. It might just be materials that we can get, but haven't. Look at all that good stuff. Do it a second time, if it'll let me. There we go. I have plenty of money, so... Shady penguin fossil. Nice. Oh, trade upon. This is not one of the people I need to talk to. Is it red red? Do you have a moment? We've been asked by Shil Shil to... Well, well, not often see human on errand. Shil Shil will ask friends to collect these thing, right? Yes? Like Shil Shil too lazy to use own feet. Make all not on look bad. A blue stone, thanks. Red Red has said peace. Much obliged to humans. Red Red and Zoka not forget such thing when doing business. Zoka is lovely pond. Friends should visit it if have time or inclination. Will do, thanks. Always nice to have more friends. Nice. What's over here though? Because I see that there's a path over here and I just kinda wanna see it. I'll open the containers in a second. Oh, there's a husk down here. Cool. Affinity. It's time to break out the razor headset I had stopped using because it was not working with my old PC. Wow. Jewel really is cringe. Our razor headset. Listen to you. Yeah, I'll get the containers. Don't worry. I remember. So now the only side quest that we can complete that we haven't is turning in those materials for the Levness. Awesome we can do that whenever, I guess. Nice Gold coins from this. Yo, that's pretty Please good. Be good. Please be good. You are. It's night time already. 